yours today. <laughs> you have some gold, but you could do with more. Um, you have never done time in a cell, unlike me. You are not exactly well traveled. Not yet, anyway. Not in Skyrim. You are essentially homeless right now. Happy guild. Uh, let me think. Like me, you have no great talent for fighting with magic. Ugh. The state of your mind may be up for debate, but your body is healthy. <laughs> when you open your mouth, you usually talk yourself into trouble, not out of it. You need to practice your manipulation techniques. Ooh, noted. You are strong, free, and single. And we'll be happy your to remain that way. Your skill with one-handed weapons is getting better. I find that shouting random insults mid-battle always helps. <laughs> In life, you tend to go your own way. You do not follow the herd. You have great fashion sense. Oh, thank you. Uh, let's see. Two-handed weapons do not seem to suit you. I feel the same way. They are heavy and cumbersome. You are not into politics. Uh, what else? You grow more sneaky every day. Keep at it. Being heard is often the difference between life and death in our line of work. True, true. You may know how to open a book, but so far you have failed to learn very much from the writing inside. Well... What have I missed? Oh, your archery still needs work. I'm working Do on it. Do not be disheartened. I am an oddity. Not everyone can be deadly with a bow and good looking. <laughs> now, how do I conclude? You are destined for greatness, my friend. Aww. You are still fairly new to this adventuring thing, but you are getting more powerful every day. That is that. I hope you enjoyed my insight. I did very much, my friend. Let us chat, shall we? I've had too many mead, I think. But... Yes, why not? Chatting is good. Really Chatting is very good. What do you think of Skyrim so far? I know you mostly operate it out of Cyril. It has many troubles, but it is worth protecting. There is much beauty in this land. Do you like it here? Ah! Uh, sort of. I think Skyrim's trouble is going to have trouble with us, no? Yes, with me also. We will be legends, my friend. What do you think they will call me in the songs? Oh. Inigo... Inigo the Brave. Or the Bold. Or something like that, no? I think so. Yes, Inigo the Brave. I like it. I am worthy of the title. Just hearing you say it makes me want to jump into a dragon's mouth. Oh, please don't. Those things are big. They would eat Khajiit whole, I think. Let us talk about something else, no? Okay. Uh... Hmm. Why do you like Riften so much? It is kind of buggy. Rumbling. The smells, the sounds, the danger. It suits me very much. It feels alive. This one admires that. What do you think of the Thieves Guild, by the way? Yes. I've been meaning to ask, but... Vex turned me away when I tried to join. Oh, no. I tried to impress her by picking her pocket. It was a bad move. Yeah, no kidding. <sighs> do you... What brought you to Riften the first time? After I quit the bandits, I came to Riften looking for a way to make coin. My partner and I found a job or two, but the real bounty was the city itself. Right. I like Riften too. It is very... it's woody. Of course you do. You have taste and ambition. I have something, that's for sure. Do you think the Thieves Guild is a good thing? I'm trying to decide this for myself, and it is... Good for thieves. Not so good for everyone else. They're usually only a menace if you're rich and stupid. <laughs> they have my vote, to be honest. I like making trouble for rich and stupid people. Alright. Uh, okay. Yeah, I think that is enough for now. Khajiit is tired. Get enough? And probably has had one too many meats. If you think I but I would like ahead, to ask you something ask else. Away. You're out of your mind. Uh, Doing could you tell me more mistake. about your past? On, or yourself? I like yourself better. 
Hey, tell me about yourself. My senses rule me. If something smells good, I cannot resist. <laughs> okay, like sweet rolls. Is that some? Is there anything else? I like hearing about you, Inigo. I like talking about myself. I am very interesting. I agree. You are very, very interesting. I'm pretty handy in a fight, uh, even if I do say so myself. I agree with you. You are very handy to have around. Uh, I need to practice, I think. Fire away. Is there anything you could tell me about your past? Like, um, what happened with the bandits or something? I was bullied by the other Khajiit children because of my unusual color and markings. Oh. My mother showed me a handy trick with a rock and a glove. I was never bothered again. <laughs> I am glad. Serves the little outs right. Khajiit children can be such cats, can't they? Yes. Bullies should not be tolerated. They soon learned that being different is not a weakness. It is not. You are correct. I should probably get some sleep, but I want to know more about your past. My father showed my brother and I how to use a sword. My mother taught us the bow. Happy childhood memories. He. My mother taught me how to make plants and do things. And I didn't really get to know my father. Okay, talk to you later. And if I'm going to go to bed on that note. With the Empire, come to extort we more from me? Much oh to boy. Sorry, I'm afraid I can't help you much right now. That's a lot of people Currently all at once. Khajiit does not want yeah. any of it. What's your problem? My problem is that I am drunk and tired. Mostly tired. Taylor, another round. <laughs> oh, no thank you. I think you've had plenty, Volwolf. Maybe you should head on home. Yeah. Good evening. Stupid Do you want to get out? I said, give me some more drink, e or I'll have your head on a pike. Well, at least I'm not as drunk as he is. Helga, we need to stop seeing each other. I wonder who this is. Oh, Bola, you silly man. You weren't saying that when you were looking at honey <laughs> off my... Helga, that's just it. I can't keep up with you, your debelling techniques. They're exhausting. I was is right. Is it really me, or is it your wife? Oh. You need to make a choice, Bully. The honey, or her. <laughs> oh boy, there is some interesting things going on down there. Alright. I should probably drink some water and not something uh, else. But, I cannot help myself. It is very, very good. Very sweet, and very good. Okay, now I'm very ready for bed. You know? Yes. I just want to let you know that I sleep with daggers, so don't try anything. Okay? Okay. Good. Uh. Uh. uh I was not that drunk. Oh boy. Sleep well. Like a kitten. But uh, where am I? And who are you? Uh, she does questions. Many questions. Does it matter? You're warm, dry, and still very much alive. That's more than can be said for old Grelard, hmm? Ah, you'll know about that. That's interesting. Half of Skyrim knows. Old hag gets butchered in her own orphanage. Things like that tend to get around. Well, that's fair. Oh, but don't misunderstand. I'm not criticizing. It was a good kill. Old Crone had it coming. And you saved a group of urchins to boot. Uh -huh. But there is a slight... Mm, problem. A uh, problem? How so? Uh... Zetas does not very much like where this is going. You see, that little Aretino boy was looking for the Dark Brotherhood. For me, and my associates. You mean they're still- Grelod the Kind was, oh. by all rights, a Dark Brotherhood contract. A kill that you stole. A kill you must repay. Ah. You want Zetas to murder someone else? I take it? Who? Well now. Funny you should ask. 
Uh, if you turn around, you'll notice my guests. I've collected them from... Well, that's not really important. The here and now. That's what matters. You better not have anyone because she knows. There's a contract out on one of them, and that person can't leave this room alive. But, oh, which one? Go on. See if you can figure it out. Well, that is a... Make your choice. Make your kill. I just want to observe and admire. Oh, you are an interesting person. They test will do this. Fuso ze vardar. Kill without qualm, yes? That is how we do things? See, I knew we could resolve this civilly. A debt owed must be repaid. You understand that? Eh, uh, Kajit understands well, many things. Get to it then. Pick your guest and send the poor fool to the void. Mm. I'll give you the key to this shack and you'll be on your way. Oh, it is locked. Got it. This one is very wondering how they got how you got blood all the way up the wall. What time is it? It is way too early in the morning. Okay. One moment please. This one does not want to get blood all over her very pretty dress because that would be awkward. And very hard to... How? 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 This one does not want to know. Okay. This one will change in a moment. I do not recognize any of you. I... I can hear you talking out there. Please let me go. I've done nothing to you. Right. Who are you exactly, hmm? My name is Fulltime. I'm a soldier. Well, mercenary, really. You know, a, a, a sellsword. I've lived in Skyrim all my life. That's all. I'm a nobody, really. So, can't you just let me go? Uh, would someone pay to have you killed? If you are a nobody? What? Oh, God. I don't want to die. Uh, nobody ever wants to die. It is okay. Do not be afraid. You can tell this one. She used to be a bandit, you know. Okay, well, I guess it's possible. I've been selling my sword arm for years now. It killed a lot of people. Could be someone wanted revenge. But, uh, but you're not going to kill me, right? Eh. I don't know yet. Uh, uh, what did I do? Uh, please, whatever it is, I'm sorry. Okay. And how about you? Get these things off of me. Oh, great. You sound like Relod. Who are you? None of your damn business who I am. If you're going to kill me, just do it already. Hm. Edmara is my witness. If I didn't have this hood on right now, I would spit right in your face. A grumpy old woman, huh? I don't have time for this nonsense. I've got a home to keep and children to feed. Now, let me out of here! Whoever this is, clearly we got off on the wrong foot. Ah, uh, but no worries. This is not the first time I have been bagged and dragged. Uh -huh. Cowards. Stealing a woman from her home. For shame. Alright, I'm going to ask you if someone would pay to have you killed and you are going to answer. Yes? Excuse me. What kind of question is that? A poorly worded one. Alright, one last time. Alright, it is alright, yes? Just answer the question and this one will free you. I'm a woman living in Skyrim with six children and no husband. I don't have the time or the patience to be nice. Oh. Do some people look down on me? Have I made some enemies? You're damn right. Okay, I see. I don't have time for this nonsense. I've got a home to keep and children to feed. Now, let me out of here. Eh? Maybe. Let me guess, that one has a contract either from her ex-husband or one of her children. Come now, whatever the problem, we can talk about it like civilized folk, hmm? Yes, who are you, brother? This one is fellow Khajiit. Ah, Varsha, at your service. 
obtainer of goods, taker of lives, and defiler of daughters. <laughs> have you not heard of me? Nope. Perhaps I will have my people carve my name in your corpse as a reminder. Well, you are a rude bun, yes? I feel the need to ask if someone would pay to have you killed, but I think you've already answered that question. Me? <laughs> are you serious? Well... We are kinsfolk, no? You might as well talk, talk to me. <laughs> the real question is, would someone pay to have me killed again? A day goes by without someone trying to cut me in the street. I get disappointed. All right, well. Tell you what, you release me and I promise my associates will not hunt you down like an animal and butcher you in the street. It is a win-win. That is not a very good proposition, Mr. Vasha. Okay, Khajiit knows this game. The test is going to guess that, uh, one moment, now would be a good time to change. Where? Is there it is. This one is glad to know that you have not taken her things and have just transported her here. Alright, Khajiit sees your game. No? The test is aware that she has a contract on her head because she has been attacked before. Khajiit is also aware that I think all of them have contracts on their head, in which case they will probably all die anyway. So, it really doesn't matter which one I pick. Because you will take care of the rest. Am I wrong? Do you have a contract on your head as well? Miss whoever you are? It is curious, no?